In 1881, Dr. John Watson returns to London after serving in the Second Anglo-Afghan War, and starts looking for a place to live. An old friend tells him that Sherlock Holmes is looking for someone to split the rent at a flat at 221B. Baker Street but cautions Watson about Holmes's eccentricities. Holmes and Watson meet and, after assessing each other, and the rooms, they move in. Holmes is a consulting detective, and his frequent guests are clients. After a demonstration of Holmes's deductive skills, Watson's disbelief turns into astonishment. A telegram requests a consultation in a murder case. Watson accompanies Holmes to the crime scene, an abandoned house on Brixton Road. Inspectors Gregson and Lestrade are already on the scene. The victim is Enoch Dreber of Cleveland, Ohio, and documents found on his person reveal that he has a secretary, Joseph Stangerson. On one wall, written in red, is Raha, German for revenge, which Holmes dismisses as a ploy to fool the police. He deduces that the victim died from poison and supplies. A description of the murderer. Upon moving Dreber's body, they discover a woman's gold wedding ring. Holmes places notices in several newspapers about the ring and buys a facsimile of it, hoping to draw the murderer, who has apparently already tried to retrieve the ring out of hiding. An old woman answers the advertisement, claiming that the ring belongs to her daughter. Holmes gives her the duplicate and follows her, but she evades him. This leads Holmes to believe that she was an accomplice, or perhaps the actual murderer in disguise. A day later, Gregson visits Holmes and Watson, telling them that he has arrested a suspect. He went to Madame Charpentier's boarding house, where Dreber and Stangerson stayed before the murder. Dreber, a drunk, attempted to kiss Mrs. Charpentier's daughter, Alice, which caused their immediate eviction. He, however, came back later that night and attempted to grab Alice, prompting her older brother to attack him. He attempted to chase Dreber with a cudgel, but claimed to have lost sight of him. Gregson has him in custody on this circumstantial evidence. Stangerson is later murdered. His body is found near his hotel window. Stabbed through the heart above it was written Raha. The only things Stangerson had with him were a novel, a pipe, a telegram saying J. H. is in Europe, and a small box containing two pills. Holmes tests the pills on an old and sickly Scottish terrier in residence at Baker Street. The first pill produces no evident effect, but the second kills the terrier. A young street urchin named Wiggins then arrives. He is the leader of the Baker Street Irregulars, a group of street children Holmes employs to help him occasionally. Wiggins has summoned a cab Holmes wanted. Holmes sends him down to fetch the cabbie, claiming to need help with his luggage. When the cabbie comes upstairs, Holmes handcuffs and restrains him. The captive cabbie is Jefferson Hope, the murderer of Dreber and Stangerson. To be continued in part two.